is on YouTube. I figured uh, you guys would get a kick out of this car. Obviously, I get all sorts of shit on the dyno, and sometimes I don't video at all, so I figure people might be pissed. But this is a 2002 Trans Am, I think a WS6, right? Yeah, WS6. And it has a Huron Speed bolt-on turbo kit with this Precision 7675, 3-inch exhaust, 4-inch uh, intercooler, and then uh, is this 3-inch tubing? 3-inch intercooler tubing. This is a totally stock LS1, except for it has a cam and springs. It has a brute speed blower cam in it, and it has the 6-speed, and I think it's still a 10-bolt, isn't it? Yep, for right, for right now, bucks. still a 10 bolt. He has a 12 bolt he's gonna put in. But uh, we just ran on uh, 12 pounds of boost, 12 degrees of timing, and a 12 0 air fuel. <laughs> 12, 12, 12. And it's consistently putting down in the 620, 620 range. I modified the degree of timing, moved the air fuel around, but it's, it's very consistent. It doesn't matter as far as what I'm doing with uh, moving the air fuel around. And timing it, it's pretty much making the same amount the one pull was stupid fat like 611 here was in the tens air fuel wise so it did pick up about 11 horsepower just putting it into the you know low uh, 12 0 1180 range but other than that the one pull it spun the tires real bad you can see this big ass dip spun the tires and then hooked up but pretty awesome I'm sure you guys will like this we have some dyno pulls then it has 60 pound injectors and it's actually uh, doing pretty well with those. It's at like 80%. So, pretty surprising amount of power. This turbo is like, it seems like every car with this turbo just makes amazing power. There's precision in here. Uh, yeah, I can't, I don't have a light. But uh, yeah, it even lights off great. It makes full boost of like three grand. And that's a Huron speed bolt-on turbo kit. So, well, that's it. It goes right up to like 230. It's not bad with 12 degrees of timing. Incredible. Well, I mean, that's what it likes. <laughs>